What's up guys, what's up it's your boy now Jaws, welcome back to a new vid. Now we're showing the Cor Chevrolet Corvette Z06. This is probably the best Corvette, drag Corvette in the game. This is the Corvette that most people use and always will use. Let's see, it sounds good, everything, you know. Alright, the engine you want in this car, it's one, the 1,700... 7.0 liter V8, or you could try out the 6.2 liter V8. It really doesn't matter, but most people will use the 7.0 liter V8. So this is the one you want to use always, the 506 V8. All right. So of course, dual turbo, drag tires, track, track, and the best gearbox in this car is definitely six-piece. Six-piece is the only good gear on this car. So, this is the car that most people use all the time. Garrett can actually make good launches on this car too. It's almost impossible to be Garrett in this car too, but I was able to beat him yesterday, so it's fine. But now, all that said and done, let's move on to the down force. What's up, guys? What's up, it's your boy Down Jaws? Welcome to a new vid. Welcome to the third drag build of the day. We got the Chevrolet. Well, not really. These are the two drag bids in one. We got another Chevette. This next Corvette, God, I can't spell Chevrolet, man. Corvette Grand Sport 17. This is like the second best Corvette in the game, but the Z06 still has a better launch time and it still launches better than this Corvette. But this Corvette still looks nice, even though it could have done the black and red here. It still, look, I don't like this design because it looks pretty cool. I really like this design. Even looking at the back, it looks like a good design. So. What you want on this car is actually two good engines of this car, but I think one serves us better. The 460 heat power 6.2 liter V8 and the 5.0 liter V8. These two engines give off the same exact time, but I think the 6.2 is better just because there's no 7.0 liter in here. So I think this is better. Remember, it's this one. There's actually two V8s. It's not this one right here. It's not the last one. It's actually this one right here. Pretty sure. Because in this, you got this other V8, but it drops down to three. So this one is the better engine. So that's it. Dual turbo, track tires on both, track suspension, track differential. You have the glee clutch, dragging one drag tires, and you want seven speed. Seven speed's the best gear for this car. In my standards, I see that is the best gear for this car. And now, again, we're moving on to the downforce for both cars. Car with the best launch, which is the Z06. I discovered a lot of launches with this car when Gary are doing it too. But this car is kind of different for the launch as well, of course. If you don't know how to launch this car, you're not going to be able to beat Traffic or Gary again. You're not going to be able to beat them if you don't launch this car correctly. So, the best launches I think to use for this car is 3 gear or 2 gear, which I mostly use sometimes because uh, Bash used it back in the day. Just let it go. Go down. Just shift down to two gear. Let's see there. I just saw there. You can get a lot of things if you time it correctly. You should be able to get the best launch off of it. So. Then the second best launch, I think, is second gear. Second gear is probably the, actually the best launch for this car, but you gotta learn how to control it because you can actually get that you know, thing all the way down without even touching the red line, but I really don't know how to do it though because I don't know how to, I do know how to control the launch on cars, but I don't know how to really control the needle when I'm on launch though. That's my problem. This is why I can't be with people. There, as you see there, and go, the thing goes all the way down. And just don't do it again. Just line up and just do it again. And it should be able to get the same one. As you see. 
So second gear is like the main best launch for this car, and the be third best launch for this car is one gear to two gear. <clears throat> but I've seen Garrett use this launch, and it looks very overpowered sometimes from this perspective. But he just knows how to control the launch off his car. So what you need to do is rev it up to one gear, let it hit down and shift, pretty much. On the like, let it go for like a point. 0 0.5 seconds then shift as you see there like very quickly shift and you see it goes all the way down it's pretty difficult to time so if you time this right you should be able to beat a lot of people with it See here, I'm trying to do this launch correctly. Yeah, I can't really do it, so yeah. But there we go. It was all the way down. So that's the I think that's the best launch of this car. You can use the 6.2 liter engine actually in this car and Dead Start 2. It probably beat be some people, but it's probably the best car you can you can possibly get. Best three launches you possibly get for this cafe. If you know how to control them, you should be able to launch pretty far. Alright, now we're moving on to the next Corvette, which is the Grand Sport. Sport, now we're going to show you the best launches with the Grand Sport. Oh, actually, I only bought this car two, at least one day ago. That was yesterday. I bought this car yesterday. But I, this is the with the six point the best launch with the 6.2 liter V engine. So I'm going to show you these launches. I think the best launches I think for this car right now is dead start this is wall with the 6.2 you can of course you can use the 5.0 a liter if you think it's better uh, put it up two gear two gear is like the, I think the best launch for this Corvette it's kind of pretty much the same thing as the 06 pretty much and one gear two gear that's probably the best ones I found for this car right now of course, you can maybe use three gear, but it's not. No. You three gear, your two gear, but that's still the ones I find right now. But I want to use the best one, which is two gear. The reason why people use this Corvette because it just bounces too much, pretty much off the line. It's probably people no one uses this Corvette. <laughs> bounces too much off the line. Of course, you probably use the 5.0 liter, probably to be better, but we'll see. We say if. In the comments, say if the 5.0 liter is better. Say it, and I'll try it out. I already tried it out yesterday. I don't think it's. Just... I haven't really tested it that much. It'll bounce three times. Alright guys, I hope you all enjoyed this vid. That's the Corvette C06 and the Grand Sport. I hope you all enjoyed this vid. There's going to be one more drag vid I'm going to build vid. I'm going to show it to you all today. One more car I'm going to tell you all today. And yeah, please like, comment, subscribe, but only if you want to. And this is your boy down jaws. Peace out, and I'll see you all next time.